It's this thing on. Welcome back to Big Mouth and fancy seeing you here in June. A very welcome, my friends, and especially my enemies. Come in, sit down, no touching. I don't do the touching. Now, for cry before I start, before I start, I was going to dive into the rant then, but welcome to the DCEU Extra. Now I'm going to start. For crying out loud, could you stop bitching, DC fans, about no Warner Brothers um, DC Films presence at San Diego Comic-Con 2019? Oh, the MCU have got all these reveals and we've got nothing. Joker movie, Birds of Prey, Wonder Woman 1984, in production in 2020, The Batman. The Flash movie, The Suicide Squad, New Gods, and who knows what else I forgot. That's at least four movies. And let's compare, and let's compare what Warner Brothers have got coming with their DC films to the MCU. Compared to the films that Warner Brothers are doing, the MCU slate is shit. Of course, it's been garnished with what they're doing on um, Disney+. Plus, But don't forget... Um, uh, DC uh, Universe has got some great TV shows as well. They're not interconnected with the DC world of films, but that doesn't really matter. I'll repeat, Joker movie, Birds of Prey, Wonder Woman 1984. In production in 2020, we've got The Flash, The Batman, The Suicide Squad. That is very exciting. And also on DC Universe, we also have Titan Season 2, Doom Patrol Season 2. Um, you know, so... We've got, I think we've got a better slate. I really, really do. And I don't understand why it matters that all this stuff wasn't announced via San Diego Comic Con 2019, but was announced ages ago. All right? We know these films are coming. We've had Matt Reeves on Twitter. And by the way, quite exciting as well, Ray Porter was reacting to what Zack Snyder posted about Diana and Wonder Woman chopping Steppenwolf's head off. He says, I'm not saying this happened, but let's just say it did. Um, I'm theorising, he says, but really he's speaking the truth because Ray Porter plays Darkseid in the Snyder Cut. He said, um, head rolls to Darkseid's feet. Um, Darkseid puts his feet on head. Um, so that was a bit of a leak as well from Ray Porter. Very naughty Ray, but really do appreciate that leak as well. So Ray Porter is on Twitter as Ray Porter. You can follow him. He's really great. He likes anyone who writes anything on his post. So that's awesome. As long as you're nice, of course, be nice. There's no reason not to be nice to Ray. So, yeah, stop complaining. We have got a great slate. We have got a better slate than the MCU slate. Forget the DC Universe stuff for a minute then because it's not interconnected, right? But just think about the DC movies we've got coming. And I forgot. I forgot, let's start again. No, no, no. We've got to start again. Sorry to bore you. Joker movie. Birds of Prey. Wonder Woman 1984. Shazam in production in 2020. Black Adam in production in 2020. The Flash in production in 2020. The Batman in production in 2020. The Suicide Squad in production in 2020. New Gods in production in 2020. That's six freaking awesome epic titles we are going to have in production we're going to see trailers of we're going to see on set footage of what else do you want does it really matter that this stuff wasn't announced at um san diego comic con 2019 so i don't know what you're upset about because our announced projects are better than theirs um four four love and thunder shit i'd much rather watch the shit out of birds of prey and Wonder Woman 1984. What are you moaning about? They've got nothing. They have nothing, right, compared to what we've got. Yes, the DCEU has been a divisive film franchise that I love, by the way, right? Blah, blah, blah. They made a mistake with Justice League, but the rest of the films are awesome. And we've got more awesome films to come. So can I, can you just please let me know in the comments what exactly are you bitching about? 